Okay, where did you go? There you are. Okay. What's this? Uh, I was skateboarding. Skateboarding and I hit a tree and I hurt my arm and I hurt my leg. Ouch. So are you ready though? Are you ready for the test? Okay, let's start. Boom, boom, here is the first slide. Are we recording? Yes. We are, yes, we all, I can see it. We are recording. Okay, here we are. More one, video test two. Uh, say as much as you can, give as much information as possible and be clear when you speak. Speak clearly and good luck. So can you introduce yourself? Please. Hello, my name is Huang Fu. I'm 10 years old. I'm from Vietnam. My favorite color is red. Okay. And what city do you live in, Huang Fu? I live in Hanoi. Okay. And how do you feel today? I feel happy. Happy. Okay. Why do you feel happy? Because Today I uh, I I play football with my father. Hey, very good. And uh, what else did you do today? You play football with your father. Did you do anything else? Yes, I play the game. Okay, very good. Okay, here's the next part of the the test. Can you please ask me politely? for three of the dishes that you see in this picture. Okay. May I have rice, please? Yes, you may, of course. Here you are. Enjoy. Okay. May I have sausages, please? Yes, of course. Here you are. Can I have chicken, please? Yes, of course. Here you are. Now I would like to ask you some questions. Would you like to have some bun cha? Yes, of course. Here you are. Okay. And how about this? Uh, would you like to have some cheeseburgers with mam tom? Yes, of course. Here you are. Of course, cheeseburgers with mom tom. Okay, uh, very good. Okay, now this part of the test, we are going to complete the sentences. Um, so using a verb and the adverb of frequency. So how often do you blank tea for breakfast? Can you do that one, please? Uh, I never... Never have tea for breakfast. Great. And number two? Number two is I eat soup for lunch. Ah, but how often do you eat soup for lunch? Uh, I never eat soup for lunch. I see. Okay. And number three? Number three is I drink milk. Okay, how often do you drink milk? We're trying to practice. This is the test is how often do you drink milk? I always drink You Okay, I understood that you said I always drink milk. And number four, can you do answer that one, please? Number four, I eat an egg for breakfast. Uh, how often do you eat an egg for breakfast? Uh, sometimes, always, often, never. Sometimes, sometimes I eat an egg for breakfast. Okay, and number five? We have fish on five. Oh, yeah. How often? Sometimes, always, often, or never? We uh, we, we some 
one time half fish on Friday. Okay, great. And number six. I never. No, no. I. I always eat rice and curry. Okay, you always eat rice and curry. Now I will ask you some questions, Huang Fuk. What do you never do? I never, ne never play the piano. You never play the piano, okay. And what do you always do? I always do my homework. Oh, good for you. And what do you often do? I often... I often play games. You often play games. And why do you often play games? Because, because the play the game is very... Uh, is it boring to play a game? No, very happy. It's very happy. Okay, very happy. Boink. Okay, here is the next part of the test. Um, so just to start off with, can you tell me what is the person doing in picture three? Picture three, the boy is watching TV. Boy well, is watching TV. So what I want you to do, we want you to do in the test is to make five sentences using the pictures, using these 12 pictures. You must use an adverb of frequency, like sometimes, never, always, often, and also a time. For example, okay. you can say, I always walk the dog at 5.30 p.m. So it's your okay. turn, Wong Fook. Please say five sentences. Okay. I never, never play the piano. Okay, you never play the piano at what time? I, I often, often play football. Okay, at what time? You often play football at what time? The example? Uh, mm -hmm. at, uh, at five o'clock. Okay, very good. That's two sentences. I... I play the game. I no. I often play the game at <laughs> half past three. Whoa, that was a great usage of half past three. Very good. Okay, two more sentences, please. I. I always watching TV at at eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. Okay, one more, please. I do. I always do my homework at at. Well, I'm sorry. At mm -hmm. this, this Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Very good. Thank you. And here is the next part of the test. It's about can and like, love, and hate. So you're going to look at these pictures and say if you can or can't do the action, then say if you like, love, or hate the activity. For example, I will ask you, can you swim? You will say, yes, I can. I love swimming. So can you dance, Huang Fu? Yes. I can. Okay. And how do you feel about dancing? Do you like, love, or hate dancing? I, I like dancing. All right. Very good. And how about, can you play basketball? Uh, yes, I can. Okay. And do you like, love, or hate basketball? I like playing basketball. 
Okay, and one more. Can you go shopping? Yes, I can. Do you, and how do, do you like love or hate going shopping? I love going shopping. You love going shopping, and where do you go shopping? I go shopping in Eon. Eon. Okay, very good. And last one, look at the picture and say where five items of clothing are. I will ask you where some clothes are. So, where is the t-shirt, Huang Fu? Can you see the picture? It's on the chair. It's on the chair. And do you have a t-shirt, Huang Fu? Yes. Okay. What color is your T-shirt? Or does it have a design on it? Does it have a picture on it? Tell me about your T-shirt. Uh, I have uh, the, uh, red T-shirt. Okay. And where do you wear your red T-shirt? I wear at home. At home. Awesome. And where is the sweater in the picture? Sweater is on, on the floor. On the floor. And where, and do you have a sweater? Yes, this is my sweater. You have a sweater? Okay, no, what? No, it's a sweatshirt. Sweatshirt, sweater, okay. Tell me about your sweatshirt. What color is your sweatshirt? And does it have any pictures on it? It's uh, orange. Orange. And where do you wear your sweatshirt? Uh, at home. At home. I wear my. Please use the full sentence. I wear my sweatshirt at home. I wear sweatshirt. Or sweatshirt at home. Okay. And where are the socks in this picture? Where are the socks? Uh. Is. On, on the cupboard. On the cupboard. Excellent. Very good vocabulary. And do you have socks? Yes, I have. Okay. What color are your socks? Yes. Black. Black. And where do you wear socks? I wear... At home. At home. And one more. Last one. Where is the jacket? The jacket is on drawer. I'm sorry. I didn't say that. I didn't hear that. Can you say that again, please? Wall. On the... Okay. I didn't quite understand that. Maybe we'll listen to that later. Oh. On the wardrobe. I... Okay. Um... Do you have a jacket, Huang Fu? It's drawer, drawer. Oh, drawer. Okay, yes, that is correct. The jacket is on the drawer. Very good. And do you have a jacket? Huang Fu? Yes, I have. Okay, what color is it? Uh, yellow and blue. Yellow and blue. And where do you wear your yellow and blue jacket? It's, uh, hmm. hmm. Do you wear it to Aeon Mall? To Aeon? <clears throat> yes. Okay. Can you say the full sentence, please? I I wear I wear. Yellow and blue, blue jacket in Eon. Okay, there we go. You're finished with your test. Very good. Goodbye, Wang Fu. Goodbye, Wang Fu.